Hey buddies, my name is Crap Chin Strap and welcome back to Would You Rather. First question, would you rather pee your pants once a day at a random time or poop your pants once a day at a random time? I'd have to go with pee your pants because I don't know, you could probably spray some deodorant on it and it'd be alright. You can sort of dry it out a little bit. Maybe go without underwear, but if you poo your pants, that that that's gonna get everywhere. That's gonna dribble down down your legs and it's gonna stain and it's not now nah, I'd have to pee I'd have to pee my pants. And most people agree. Cool. If your mom was to die, would you rather marry an unattractive 64-year-old and drink your cat's pee every morning for breakfast in order to save her? <gasps> Or let her die. Um, I gotta be honest. I really love my mum and everything, but I don't think I could, <laughs> I could drink a cat's pee every morning for breakfast. I don't know if I could do that. I mean, maybe there'd be a way around flavouring it or something like that. You know, turning it to milkshake, maybe cat pee milkshake. Uh, but then I'd have to marry an unattractive 64-year-old, and that'd just be kind of awkward. Because I'd be there like, oh, dee 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 dee, living life to the fullest. And she'd be like, oh dear, oh dear, my hip's broken again. Don't know why she sounds like an old British person, but they're an old British man. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'd have to let my mum die, I think. I don't know if I could do that to myself. Most people agree, so that's all right. <laughs> Would you rather ski in the mountains or vacation on the beach? Ski in the mountains! I don't like the heat, as I've said before. Okay, most people don't agree, but there we go. Would you rather watch The Big Bang Theory or watch The Office? Watch The Office. I love The Office. I love both versions of The Office, UK and US. It's so awesome. Ah, uh, yeah. Would you rather be a rich but stupid footballer or be a genius but poor scientist? Well, I hate footballers. Well, the popular ones anyway. Anyone else that plays football, you know, for recreational purposes and things like that, that's fine. I have no problem with that. I, I will join in a game of football with you. That's that's fun. But the people that get paid millions and millions and millions and millions and millions just to run around on a pitch for a little bit, I just, no, no, I couldn't do that to myself. I'd want to be a genius because that, that would be interesting. If you're a genius, you'd know so much stuff and you'd be able to help people with that. And you wouldn't just be a sort of self-obsessed person. Oh, I've bought a white Bentley. Look at me. I'm so cool. No, I'd be a poor scientist. Yeah, I'd be happy with what I got. 50%? What the hell? Fucking selfish people, that is. Jesus. Okay. Would you rather eat a hot dog or eat a hamburger? Ooh. Ooh, that's a... Um, that's a tough one because I like them both. Um... I, s I suppose whenever I go to a fairground or, or a carnival or something like that, I, I eat a hot dog with loads of onions on it, so I, I probably have to say eat a hot dog. Yeah, there is more food in a hamburger technically, but there we go. Oh well. Would you rather win a one-day shopping spree to any store or win a two-week vacation to any destination? A one-day shopping spree in any store? You could go to... I, don't, I can't even think of an expensive store right now, but you could go to like a ridiculously expensive store and just get everything. And then you could sell half of it and get a two week vacation to any destination. <laughs> I mean, is that not obvious? I know, I'm gonna go to the Bugatti store. I'm just gonna buy all of their Veyrons and, oh, you know, sell half of one. I'll, I'll chop it in half and sell half and then go on vacation with that money. Cause that's, that's like 500 grand right there, isn't it? For half a Bugatti Veyron. People are stupid. What is wrong with people? Why would you go for the vacation over the vast amount of wealth where you could buy your own- Oh god, I don't know, people are just weird. Would you rather eat your hands and feet or eat your whole dad? <laughs> what? <laughs> Father! Oh god, um... <laughs> That's a bit weird. I don't know, um... I suppose they could call me Stumpy, or I could- Oh no, I could get bionic hands and, and feet, because they've got them now. Oh my god, yeah, eat my hands and feet, yeah, because then my dad would be happy, and then I could high-five him with a metal bionic hand. That'd be cool. Yeah, eat my hands and feet. Hell yeah. Would you rather jump forward ten years of your life, or go back ten years of your life? Do you get to remain there, or do you, is it just a temporary thing? 
I'd probably go 10 years back and just be be like, hey, invent the iPhone or something, you know. Because, <laughs> yeah, I could I could set myself up for success there. That That's a good plan. Yeah, I'd do that. Hell yeah. Would you rather fight in the Civil War or the Revolutionary War? Now, is this the Captain America Civil War? Because, hell yeah, then I'd have superpowers. The Revolutionary War? Mm, yeah, no, I'm going to go Civil War because... Hooray for superpowers! I know, I know the Civil War is a genuine war. I'm just trying to be funny here. Don't hate me. <laughs> Would you rather drive a smart car or drive a Lamborghini and fill up four times a week? You have to fill up four times a week anyway with a Lamborghini. It just... Any sports car, like, completely drains all of its gas, petrol, whatever you want to call it, whichever country you're from. So, that... that... I... yeah. I'd have a Lamborghini, because... You'd be filling it up all the time anyway. I don't, I don't care. That's fine. <laughs> Would you rather live in a homeless shelter with internet access or live in an amazing home isolated from any outside contact? Um. Oh, that's tough. I do like my isolation. I'm not going to lie. I don't like being in towns and stuff. There's too many people. Too, too many people. It annoys me. Um. Ah, if it lived in a homeless shelter, then just, no, because no, living in a homeless shelter would be rough. You wouldn't really have any food, but is, if I lived in an amazing home, even though it might be isolated, I could still drive and get food. Um, and I could just use mobile internet. So, <laughs> problem solved. I've got an amazing house. Just have to use mobile data. As a 15-year-old, what? Wait a minute. Up. I could have sworn I was older than that. My balls, yeah, my balls have dropped. I'm definitely older than 50. Well, that's not a gauge just how old a 15 year old is. You don't go around like seeing all 15 year olds going, ah, oh, my balls haven't dropped yet. Well, it's more like, ah, oh, my balls haven't dropped yet. <laughs> what am I talking about? I'm spouting gibberish from my mouth hole. As a 15 year old, would you rather hate your parents but have to be with them 24 7 or love your parents but have them both died of a horrible, gory death right in front of you? I'd rather hate my parents, because at least they'd still be there. Jesus Christ, that's a bit sinister. 33% want to kill their parents, is what they're saying there. Would you rather lick a person's leg if they say, Hello. I'm assuming that's what they're saying. Or, ampersand quat, semicolon, hello, ampersand quat, semicolon. <laughs> if someone said that sentence, then yeah, I'd go for that, because I wouldn't ever have to lick anybody. Or would you, you bite the person's finger if they say percent quad? Um, I'd lick their leg because at least they wouldn't feel pain. They might even be satisfied from it and you might find yourself a new sexual partner. I don't know. That's a weird one. Lick them. Definitely. Why would you bite? Mm. I was licking someone's leg. Like, worse than biting someone's finger. You can bite their finger off. That's not... Oh, God. Would you rather be born a dwarf or be born with, without third of your legs? What? Without a third? What third is it? Is it the top third so that I don't have any legs, but I just have two thirds of legs, like just in my garage somewhere? <laughs> um, I, hmm, I don't know how that would work, but I'd, I'd probably go for the third of legs because if it was the lower half of the third, then I could get those. Those cool, you know, bouncy legs that you can get. You know, the kangaroo sort of steppy ones that boing, boing, boing. I can get some of those and I could just like canter everywhere. It'd be awesome. Would you rather have supernatural agility or have supernatural strength and intelligence? Well, stu supernatural strength and intelligence would always be more handy because I'd be intelligent. I could figure out pretty much any situation and the strength would always help. But if I had a supernatural agility, I could just do things fast. I'd still be a moron. Because I'm pretty stupid. Yep, yep, yep. Strength and intelligence for the win. Cool. Okay, final question. Would you rather date Tupunga from Boy Meets World or date Pam from The Office? I have no idea who the hell Tupunga from Boy Meets World is. And actually, Pam from The Office is kind of hot. I quite like her. And she's an artist. I like creative people. And The Office is just generally awesome. It's one of my top ten shows of all time. Freaking love it. So yeah, Pam, hell yeah. She's hot. Nice. Well, <laughs> I'm 
Cool. Some random questions there. If you've enjoyed the episode, like, comment, subscribe, and do what you YouTubers do. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace out for now. Bye bye. Uh, wrecking ball. I came in like a wrecking ball. I don't know what the lyrics are. <laughs> Fucking Miley Cyrus. Oh.